What's up, Pisces gang? Thank you guys so much for joining me today. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. If this is your first time here, welcome. I am Quisha here with Abundant Healing. I was sent here from the universe to give you guys some good messages, some good love, some good healing, some good readings. I was sent here to give it to you. That's exactly what I'm doing. So thank you so much for joining me today. Welcome to your daily money reading, okay? We do these every day or we try to do these every day. Um, So if you want more... um videos like this where you are receiving channel messages from the universe on how you can become more abundant and you can become a millionaire or you can just attract more money into your life then go ahead and hit that subscribe button also make sure you turn on your bell notification that way you will be notified every time i post a video like this okay so thank you guys so much for being here thank you guys for all the support thank you for the people who are still with me i know i've been falling off and falling on and falling off and coming back and going up it's just been a you know roller coaster right now in my life so <laughs> thank you guys so much for sticking it through with me and just always being here to support your girl i really appreciate you guys and you you know who you are okay so thank you so much um again i'm not gonna waste any more time like comment subscribe if anything in this message resonates with you i would gladly appreciate that comment below let me know what resonated with you let me know what birthday you have in pisces season let me know what you know if your moon is a pisces or if you're um rising as a pisces or whatever the case may be i would love to communicate with you guys and, and and engage with you guys and know more about you guys and i would want you to know more about me so any questions that you may have go ahead and drop them in the comment section below okay so without further ado let's jump right into your daily money reading okay universe what messages do you have for me to give to the beautiful pisces collector today in regards to money in regards to their finances, in regards to success, what messages, what advice can I give the Pisces collective today that's watching in regards to money, in regards to their income, in regards to their careers and their jobs? What messages and what advice can I give the Pisces watching today? Guys, I have adjusted all of the settings to make sure that you guys can hear me. So for those of you who say that you can't hear me, I would advise that you adjust your volume um, but I have, I have adjusted everything um, to make sure that um, my voice is being heard. I, I don't want to yell at you guys. I feel like I'm already talking loud. There's a wall in front of me, so my voice is like bouncing off of this wall. So, um, you know, I don't want to yell at you guys. But if you can't hear me, please just adjust your volume or just put on some headphones, okay? All right, so let's jump into it. I'm excited to see what the universe has to say for you guys in regards to money. Universe, please bring in the most relevant messages for the Pisces collected today in regards to money. Now, there is a card that I already turned over, and it is right here. The Ten of Wands. Okay, let's see what else we have. So, somebody is picking up a lot. Okay. So I was picking up a lot of things that you are probably trying to take on at one time. Someone here is very ambitious, very goal-oriented, very driven. Um, showing up here at the bottom, you have the Knight of Cups, followed by the King of Swords and the Seven of Pentacles. On the top, we have the Strength card, followed by the Magician, followed by the Two of Swords. Okay, if somebody is juggling a lot, somebody is dealing with a lot, somebody has put a lot on their plate, um, one of you guys here are doing multiple things at a time. Maybe you have multiple jobs, maybe you have multiple streams of income, maybe you have multiple businesses, um, or you just, and even if you haven't started, maybe you just have an idea, or maybe you're just passionate about more than one thing or maybe your creative um wheels are just turning and you have so many ideas that are coming out and you're trying to do everything at once um or you're just trying to do a lot at one time you're trying to work multiple jobs you're trying to just do a lot at one time with the 10 of wands showing up here the universe is saying to um give yourself a break okay remember that um there's a difference between staying busy and staying productive, 
Okay, you can be busy all day and not get anything productive done, okay? So what you're doing is burning yourself out. Now, when the, the thing about being productive is when you're productive, you it's not about how much work you're doing, but being productive is also knowing when to take a break, okay? Knowing when to pull back, knowing when to, you know, not exude yourself so much on one task. Knowing that, you know, if you are you know, stressed or, or you're feeling, your mind is feeling a little cloudy or cloggy or whatever the case may be, you know that it's time to just like, wait a minute, let me just fall back for a second and just take a break, you know, delegate some of these tasks if you can, you know, if you're in that type of um, field or if you're at that level where you can delegate your task to other people or, you know, just take the load off, like take a load off. That's what the universe is saying. Just take a load off. Don't feel like you have to do everything at one time. Okay. Pace yourself, embrace yourself and give yourself some grace. All right. And know that everything is going to happen for you at the right time. Okay. You don't have to rush and try to do everything at one time. Just be patient. Okay. You're going to get everything done because you're passionate. There's so much passion that you have about what it is that you want to accomplish. And you may be thinking about doing something uh, great for your family. You may be wanting to um, get your family on a solid ground and a solid foundation and make sure that you're doing everything to not let your family down because you are the person that your family is leaning, leaning on. But the universe is saying to pace yourself. Don't feel like you have to do everything at one time, okay? You also have the nine of wands showing up here. This is telling me that someone here has been fighting for what they want. You have been not giving up you have been literally working in in just without breaks no days off okay you have been like <laughs> you've been going at it like you've been um what's that word what's the saying where they say uh you've been <laughs> i don't know why a railroad is in my mind like there's some type of you've been working on a railroad all the living long but that song just popped up in <laughs> <laughs> Do y'all know that song? I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. <laughs> That's what just came up in my mind. So somebody here has been working. Okay, I'm trying to think of the words to that song. Can't you hear the whistle blow? Somebody comment below if you if you remember this song. I believe this was a song that I remember back in kindergarten or something like that if you remember this song please comment below because i would love to know who knows this song and if you know this song this message is for you because <laughs> it literally just popped up in my head because i feel like somebody here has been toiling away at work you have been like you you know what you want to do you 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 have your mind set to this creative thing and you are not giving up. And what you're doing is you're laying a solid foundation for you and your family. You're laying a stable foundation, something that cannot be broken, something that cannot be um, easily um, destroyed, okay? I feel like what you're doing right now is you're dedicating your time and energy towards something that is going to benefit you and your family in the long run. Okay, you're not worried about a quick um, uh, get rich scheme. You're not worried about fast money. You are focused on long-term um, goals, okay? But you are putting the action. You're putting the passion. You're putting the work in. Um, you're putting the work into your goals. You're putting a lot of energy into your passion, okay? And as long as you continue to do this every single day, consistency is going to show up and show out in the future, okay? So, but what I feel like is all of your work is going to pay off, Pisces. Everything that you are doing right now is going to show, okay? I feel like you are coming to a chapter in your, you are, yeah, you are coming to a chapter in your life where you will be able to sit down and relax and take a break and take the load off and be able to enjoy a luxury lifestyle okay i feel like you will have this happily ever after type of 
um, reality because I know a lot of us, we live in a fantasy world, but that's just what we want for ourselves and our family. And I feel like this is where you're headed. Okay, you're closing a chapter of struggling. You're closing a chapter of worrying about when the next check is going to come. Living paycheck to paycheck. You're closing that chapter. And you are opening up a new chapter full of love, full of abundance. Okay, full of joy, full of bliss. You know, but you're still going to be productive because like I said, there's a difference between being busy and productive. And you will soon find that out. Okay, that being busy is not, um, just because you're staying busy does not mean that you're being productive. Okay, I really, really want you guys to understand what that means, okay? Because you can be busy, but not productive, okay? So, continue to be productive, Pisces. Continue to put the work in. Continue to work on the railroad every single day, okay? And you may have to juggle multiple things. You may have to juggle your family life or your work life in your... um in your personal life you may have to find a balance between your work life and your personal life and that's productivity okay being productive is not about staying busy and you don't have enough time to sit down with your kids and help them with their homework or you don't have enough time to cook dinner that's just we don't want to do that we want to make sure that we are finding a balance between our work and our life okay because the the people who love you that are always supporting you are the ones that matter the most okay they matter more than money so you want to make sure that you put them at the top of your priority to do list okay you don't want to neglect your family you don't want to neglect your loved ones or the ones that are supporting you you don't want to neglect them okay you want to make sure that you put time aside to spend with the loved ones to spend with your family whoever it may be your kids your wife, your spouse, your girlfriend, your boyfriend, whoever it may be, you want to make sure that you are putting time aside for them, okay? It's all about balance. It's all about balance, okay? We have to have a work-life balance, a healthy work-life balance, all right? Now, I want to uh, incorporate these questions back into the readings so I would like for you guys to, at this moment to just ask a question in your head or out loud, whichever feels good for you. And I want to answer your question with these cards. Okay, so just take the time as I'm shuffling these cards to ask a question in your head or out loud to the universe. And let's see what the universe is going how the universe is going to answer your question or what the universe is going to say in regards to your question all right let's see what the universe is saying in regards to your question what does the universe say oh there's three that came out here we're going to take the one on top first all right so question number one says recovery okay so whatever question that you ask is saying recovery recovery means heal heal yourself first okay make sure that you are healing properly all right second remain positive okay so whatever this question is you need to just continue to remain positive don't look at the negative outcome that could come behind the situation but always look at the positive side look at the bright side of things last is don't stop okay don't stop doing what you're doing don't stop toiling away at work but again know when to take a break but continue to do what you are doing right now in life okay and everything that is going everything that is meant to you is going to come to you at the right time at the perfect time okay let me give you a message from the angels before i close you out let's see what angel message can we give you today the rest what message from the angels can we give a beautiful pisces watching today thank you universe Celebrate life. Continue to be thankful for the things that you have in life. This card says, I celebrate every day by honoring and respecting all life on Mother Earth 
Get out into nature, Pisces. Get out into nature. Go put your feet in some grass. Go smell a tree. Go hug a tree. Go smell a flower. I don't know. Whatever you need to do, get out into nature. Celebrate life. Become one with all living things on earth. And once you do that, you will start resonating from a very high frequency because you would understand that everything is connected. Okay? Just like how you see this um symbol here on this card if i can pick it up <laughs> you see that symbol on that card on this card this little symbol right here this is symbolizing that everything is connected okay everything that is alive and living is connected to you i mean like from the ants to the birds in the sky we are all connected so you need to learn to appreciate life if you don't Learn to appreciate um, breathing. Learn to appreciate the elements that we have. Fire, um, water, air, and earth. Learn to appreciate these necessities that we need in order for us to live on this beautiful God green earth. Okay? Celebrate your life. Be thankful. Be grateful for the things that you already have. You will start resonating from a very high frequency. You will be able to attract everything that you want in your life as long as you are grateful for the things that you already have okay pisces that is my message to you beautiful pisces thank you so much for watching thank you so much if you made it to the end of this video let me hear you in the comments let me know what was your question i want to know what questions did you guys ask i just like to know um just so i can make sure that i'm on the right path i want to make sure that i'm doing the right thing for you guys let me know if you want more questions or let me know if i could just just take this out all the way i would love your feedback so comment below let me know how you enjoyed this reading let me know what resonated with you in this reading okay guys thank you so much for watching again i love you beautiful pisces if you want to support the channel all the links are down below in the description box i love you and i hope that you are having a great day and i'll see you in the next video bye